Good afternoon. A man is dead after being shot by Montreal police. They considered that man a murder suspect in three deadly shootings that happened within 24 hours of each other. The latest one last night in Laval. And Matt, there is still a large police presence. That's right, just outside of this motel here in Saint Laurent at about 7 this morning is really when it all happened. Montreal police raided this motel along Marcel Lorrain Boulevard and on scene police were met by a man in his 20s, were confronted by a man in his 20s who had a firearm. Shots were fired. The man was hit at least once and he died on scene. Now the BEI, the Bureau of Independent Investigations, is handling this file, this file specifically with what happened at the motel here. The BEI says this all had to do with the three murders that took place in recent days in Montreal and Laval. Last night in Laval around 9.30, a 22-year-old was shot to death in Laval des Rapides. 24 hours before that shooting, on Tuesday night, a 64-year-old man was gunned down in Saint Laurent. The victim in that case is André Lemieux, father of Quebec boxer David Lemieux. About an hour after that shooting, nearby in Hunsic Cartierville, 48-year-old Mohamed Saleh Belhaj was shot to death about three kilometers or so away from the earlier shooting in Saint Laurent. Now, when the BEI typically takes over an investigation, as it has here at this motel, Montreal police don't typically comment any further, but given the circumstances, interim Montreal police chief Sophie Roy decided to meet with reporters for a quick statement. Here's what she had to say. The SPVM wishes to offer, offer his deepest condolences to all families. Of course, such events cannot be tolerated. Indeed, Montrealers should feel safe to walk in each neighborhood at all times in all places. Therefore, all SPVM units are working together to fight against violence under any form and to protect citizens. I'm very proud of the work of our police officers and I wish to congratulate all units and officers who acted quickly in these matters. So three murders in a 24-hour time span. Uh, the Sûreté de Québec is also on scene here at the motel because the SQ is investigating those three murders specifically. That's in addition to what the BEI is investigating as well. And we did hear from an SQ spokesperson this morning who mentioned that the SQ believes that the individual killed this morning at the motel was a suspect in those three recent murders. Here's more now from the SQ. For the moment, it looks like they were randomly chosen uh, by the suspect. Uh, it looks like there's no link between them and the suspect. So we're going to try to know more about the causes and circumstances in the following hours. So we'll be on scene here throughout the day with more updates. Like, of course, at 12.30, we did speak to some uh, local residents as well who are quite shook up. We'll have more in about a half hour's time. Okay, we'll speak to you then, Matt. Thank you very much. Matt Grillo reporting live in St. Laurent.